Meghan Markle's ex-husband's blunt comment about Duchess, I have zero to say. Meghan Markle's ex-husband Trevor Angelson made a very blunt comment about her, according to a royal biographer. When Meghan shot to royal fame by dating and then marrying Prince Harry, there was significant interest bubbling up about her previous marriage. However, Hollywood producer and talent agent Trevor has been remarkably tight-lipped about his ex-wife, never speaking to the media about her. According to Andrew Morton's book Meghan, a Hollywood princess, Trevor was still angry about how things ended between him and Meghan. It was reportedly for this reason that he told inquirers, I have zero to say about her. In fact, Trevor was so hurt and taken aback by Meghan's sudden decision to end their marriage, it is said he does not even like to hear her name anymore. Mr. Morton wrote, It was such a surprise for Trevor that even at a distance of five years, he can barely contain his anger. The normally laid-back New Yorker switching gear from his usual high bro, how's it going? To a cold fury when her name comes into the conversation. This claim is backed up by a comment made by Meghan's half-brother Thomas Markle Jr. In an interview with Express.co.uk this year, Thomas Jr. said he has spoken to Trevor on the phone since the breakup, but that he warned him not to mention Meghan or he would hang up. Thomas Jr. claimed, I talked to Trevor a couple of times on a project that I was trying to put together. And he said, I'll talk to you. But just don't ever mention her name because I will hang up on you. I don't want to hear her name, period. Megan's friend Nanaki has also been rather blunt about Megan. Nanaki, who was friends with the Duchess for over two decades and was maid of honor at her first wedding, decided after her breakup with Trevor that she no longer wanted to be associated with her. While Nanaki has not explained what exactly happened that made her come to this decision, she has made some comments about Meghan that seem to call in to question her former friend's intentions. Nanaki told the Daily Mail, All I can say now is that I think Meghan was very calculated, very calculated in the way she handled people and relationships. She is very strategic in the way she cultivates her friends. Once she decides you're not part of her life, she can be very cold. It's this shutdown mechanism she has. There's nothing to negotiate, she's made her decision and that's it. The way she handled it, Trevor definitely had the rug pulled out from under him. He was hurt. However, another friend of Meghan's, fellow actor Abby Wathen, was more sympathetic to Meghan's side of the story. She said the pair of them bonded over the fact they went through divorce and she defended Meghan's decision. She said, she took her power back. It wasn't the right relationship for her, so she moved on. Meghan and Trevor first met in 2004 and lived together in Los Angeles for several years. They tied a knot in Jamaica in 2011, but finalized their divorce in 2013, citing irreconcilable differences. Three years later Meghan met Prince Harry, and a year after that Trevor met his now-wife, dietitian Tracy Curland. His now